Okay. Why is it about the umbrella? Or is that a fucking sword to go chipper? Find Amanda. Hello, Amanda. A bit late for that. She's stunned out in the rain. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Pizzas? Oh, no. Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. Lieutenant. It's me, Connor. I'm uh, going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! You have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. Thank Steve you in Arnold. advance for your cooperation. Lee, get the fuck out of here! Sumo! Attack! <laughs> good job. It's for your own good. Okay. Ah! Oh, turn it off! Turn it off! Ah! Give me five minutes, okay? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> This is Brian Brew, how are all of you? And today we're going to do another episode of the Trip Become Human. Let's jump in. Hello? I haven't seen you for a while. It's good to have you back. I thought I was going to get some nuggets of wisdom there, but nope. <clears throat> right, so let's jump in. The last episode was pretty amazing. Uh, we were playing as Kara, and we went to what we thought was a safe house, which turned out to be a complete shitstorm. So, let's see where the story goes next. Okay. Okay, so we're back to the port to the boss, which was down the middle, wasn't it? Right, can you walk for... We'll go this way then, because he's been a bit of a dick. Why is he walking about with an umbrella? Is that a fucking sword to go chipper? Find Amanda. I can find you, Amanda. Still pretty still in this game. It's still like it's going to change and be bad all of a sudden. But it really is mind blowing. Right. Hello, Amanda. Hello, Amanda. Hi. I've been expecting you. I bet you have. Would you mind a little walk? That late for that, she's stunned out in the rain. Congratulations, Connor. You managed to find that deviant. Tell me, what did you learn? The uh, diaries, some balls. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. What else? I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to <clears throat> decipher. You came very close to capturing that deviant. It's a pity you let it self destruct. Oh. Fuck you, Amanda. Uh. It claimed that it was innocent. That it didn't do anything wrong. I was confused for a moment. It was a mistake. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? It's improving. I've come to understand him better, and he's growing accustomed to my presence. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this, whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. It's gonna be a car, aren't it? Well, she's off the grid. Hmm. Bye, Amanda. Okay. <clears throat> so let's go find Mr. Anderson. Not to be confused with Mr. Anderson from the Matrix. We have reached your destination. Thank you for traveling with Detroit Taxi. We look forward to seeing you again soon. Right. 
think it's hostile. Oh, that's right, yeah, we forgot to catch him hanging off a ledge. Probably best try his front door. Don't want to piss him off anymore. Lieutenant Anderson! Anybody home? In fact, we should really try the door one more time, shouldn't we? Give him a chance, man. No, we're getting dingy. Got it! That dog's sleeping on the floor. Check the other window. You can do both, can't we? Wait, it. stop it, Connor! That's his new corner. There's it's on the bed. No, very craftily done. So we can't really see. Let me touch his car. Oh, this is, let me touch his car. Connor, do you sort yourself out, son? Can't really see much there, other than the fact that the car is there. Let's go. Sneak into the garage. So, we'll, yeah, it was really cleverly done. Yeah, so, we've checked both the windows, we've checked his car, we've rang the front doorbell, and we've chapped the door, and we've done an extended ring of the doorbell. So, only option is to go around the back here. Right. Pizzas? Oh no! Lieutenant Anderson! Uh, do I really need a break? Easy... Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. He's just drunk. He made an asset, I think. Too drunk, isn't he? Oh, he's puked to himself. Alcohol content forty percent proof. Okay, right. Bottles, got we want. He's past his pants. Puke all his top. Slight arrhythmia, no signs of trauma. Uh, okay, one more to go. Oh my god, gun! One bullet remaining. Just gonna top yourself. Lieutenant! <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant! It's me, Connor. Oh, you want me to go the other way? I'm uh, going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! I have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Boss Thank you in over. advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here! Okay. Sumo! Attack! <laughs> Good job. Attack! Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh. 
Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. Oh, <laughs> really? Okay. <laughs> What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Uh, let's go streaky. Does that go to influence the, the game? Uh, anything else that you're doing here? We're going to be a nosy robot, we're just going to go straight back to the bathroom. Yeah, straight back to the bathroom. <coughs> Are you alright, Lieutenant? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. I just can't handle his whiskey. Give me five minutes, okay? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Huey and Ralph is being called upon. Right, let's go and do our music. Well, he's broken, he's got some. Oh, there's always going to be a fucking newspaper thing in there. Right, page one. Time to pull a plug. Okay. Right. Oh, that's not me ruining my time to snoop about. Let's not see anything. Last thing I'm going to do is fucking harass him. Yeah. Is that a cake or a burger? Yeah, some stuff there anyway. Oh, Alright, okay, he's got a son. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right. That should take a lot of boxes then, shouldn't it? Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Bye, Sibo. Nice 
so we missed a few things there, but overall, I think we did all right. So, yeah, there's another episode done, so I'm going to leave it there. If you guys enjoy watching this episode, please drop me a like, give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to be kept up to date with future videos on the channel, the best way to do that is to subscribe, clicking that wee notification bell, and I'll let you know when I publish new content to the channel. From me and Detroit Become Human, I shall see you all in the next one. Be awesome. Bye. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.